Here we go. How's it going? Yeah, you guys could definitely hear me, uh... <laughs> you guys could definitely hear me tapping, couldn't you? Whew. So, today, uh, my goal is I want to build a Baxcalibur team. And the first half will be team building and testing it on Showdown. And then we'll be getting it in-game tonight as well. That's going to be part of my plan. So let's go ahead and start off with the, with the standard. Obviously, we got Baxcalibur. Obviously, let me go full screen actually here. No, hold on. There we go. There we go. Obviously, we want Baxcalibur. We want Obama Snow. I think that Sylveon and Gyarados aren't like bad partners. I was like planning this out at home a little bit, if you couldn't tell. Sylveon, Gyarados. Um, did I want Gothitelle for this team? Hold on. Let me look at my phone because I was like sitting in like just before the stream, like looking at my phone and like planning this out. Pokemon Showdown. Okay, no, 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 now I remember. It had Armor Rouge and um, Indeedee. Because if you don't know, Indeedee officially, we're not even sure if this is a bug yet. We're just treating it as official. Thanks for the follow, by the way. We're treating this as official because that's just what the situation demands. But uh, this is a thing that you can get in the game via raids. So you can get Trick Room Indeedee Female, which it's supposed to be exclusive to the male Indeedee, but apparently, uh, you know, we're good. Actually, that, that reminds me. Can Indeedee Male get Follow Me now? Okay. Shame. Shame. Do you get Fake Out? You do get fake out. All right. So Indeedee Female just got the exclusive move, which we're pretty sure it's a bug, but we have to pretend like it's not. Armor Roche. We, we think it's a bug, but according to like judges at Pokemon, they're like, no, it's legal if you can get it in game. You know, it's legal if you can get it, but we're pretty sure it's a bug. We're not sure. We're, we're waiting for a, an official word. We obviously still don't have official tournaments. And you can use it online. There, there, nothing gets, there, nothing is blocked online, you know. All right. So this thing's like 107 by default. If I want to outspeed Dragapult, what is it? 143. So we have to run Jolly. Pretty sure it's 143. And I'm thinking I'm just gonna do like this. Is 200 a good stat? I mean, I can probably get more out of directly investing. All right, here, hold on. Um, I wanted clear amulet on you. And I think I'm going to do like dragon dance. What ice moves do you get? His ice moves are pretty lackluster, I can't lie. What if I do Terra Ice? I feel like that's not great, though. I could, I could do Icicle Spear. And if it hits two to five times in a row, that that's probably worth it, right? So let me let me do some math. So if Icicle Spear hits two times, wait, can someone hold on? What what's the likelihood here? Icicle Spear chance. What's the chance to hit three times? Because that's what I have to look at. Thirty-seven point five percent chance it'll hit two times. Thirty-seven point five percent chance it'll hit three times. So seventy-five base power, one hundred percent accuracy, and there's like a chance it'll go up. So I think on average it's better than Icicle Crash. So I'm gonna go Spear because it's ten points lower, but Icicle Crash can miss, and I don't want to have to worry about that. I'd rather get some guaranteed damage. Um, loaded dice. Ah, but I don't want to be, I don't want to be intimidatable, you know. I don't want to be intimidatable. I like the clear amulet on him. Because I think I'm going to end up going... I don't know. I'm probably going to go goggles on something. Actually, let me steal a spread real quick. This is my current Sylveon spread that was given to me by a buddy. I don't remember what it does, but it's fine. I never know what they do. Also, I don't care if it's shiny. Go away. Go away. All right. I, obviously, I want light clay on you. We're going to run Blizzard. Or Actually, I'm going to run Protect first so people don't yell at me. You don't yell at me. Uh, if you're scared of Intimidate, why not use King Gambit? Uh, can I drop Gyarados for that? I kind of need Gyarados, to be honest. And I really like Sylveon. 
I don't know. We'll we'll see. We'll see. Maybe I can run King Gambit. Maybe not. Um Protect in the new slot. No, we have to do protect first, otherwise people yell at me. Look, I'll do it again. Bah boom. Alright. Ice Skill Spear, uh Dragon Claw. Is Dragon Stab even worth it? Oh wait, why am I not running Glaive Rush? Let's just annihilate things. <laughs> Never mind, we're good. Let's just annihilate things. Protect always goes last. What are you talking about? No. Protect is always supposed to go first if we're going by like optimization. Because in many cases, if you run out of time, the, the best outcome is for you to click protect. If you like run out of time to click your move, that's usually the best outcome. Um, what if I go Terra Ground? Oh, Terra Ground could be nasty. Do I want to Terra Ground? All right, guys, give me ideas. Give me ideas. I think I do Dragon Dance. I don't want to go Pure Ice. Maybe I just do Terra Dragon and like annihilate things with Glaive Rush. Terra Water. Is ice water all that good? Let me think. Because I I could do Terra, Terra Blast. Uh, C Punk, thank you so much for the uh for the for the sub. I'm I'm not sure, man. Like it's it's gonna be it's gonna be rough. Uh, do, do, do here. That's the hard part. Like uh. Resist fire for thermal exchange. We already resisted by being dragon type. I think we just stay dragon type and we just annihilate things because we have Indeedy, right? I think we're fine. All right. Um, and also, like, I, I don't always want to Terra this guy because I, I then I go I don't get my defense boost. All right. Uh, for Gyarados, let's do Lumberry. And I'm gonna run another dragon. Do, am I really gonna run double dragon dance? Is that maybe I don't use Gyarados? Maybe I don't use Gyarados. Maybe King Gambit is the play. I do have a Trick Room mode. Yeah, let's do King Gambit. Why not? Let's do King Gambit. I know he usually wants to be Terra Rock. Terra Rock. Um, get Sword Stance. Oh, we could be nasty with the Sword Stance. Minimum speed. I'm kind of feeling the minimum speed. You get Rock Slide. No, okay. It's going to have to be Terra Blast. Terra Blast. Uh, Kowtow Cleave. Protect or Iron Head? I'm thinking Iron Head, just no protect on him. Wide Guard Armor Rouge? Maybe. Alright, I want Terra Psychic. I think I just do Life Orb to be honest. We do like minimum speed armor rouge. See, I don't know if I want Sucker Punch though, because I do have the Indeedy. Indeed, he could mess up the Sucker Punch play. Hmm. What if I just do, um... What if I just do Annihilate, then? Yeah, Annihilate isn't bad. Uh, I kind of like that. Yeah, I kind of like Annihilate, especially since we're running, like, dual screens. We can, like, lead off Indeedy Obama Snow. And then get Annihilate in, and just, like, Rage Fist things. Yeah, let's do that. Terrifier. Uh, we run... Rage Fist. I think I run leftovers on you, honestly. Rage Fist, Defiant. I don't want to run Scarf Gambit. I like the Rage Fist set. Hmm. I had a spread for this that I was working on the other day. Where is it? It was like a concept spread. Yeah, Figgy Berries because I have leftovers on you. I could actually run Citrus Berry to be honest. And Terrifier. Just to block burns. Oh, my light turned off. Thank you, Light. You're always so consistent. Yeah, I like the bulk up setup. Like, even though we don't have any attack investment, I'm not going to lie, I think a single bulk up just kind of, like, annihilates things. Uh, and that also opens up the door for Scarf Armor Roche. Do I want to run Scarf or Life Orb? I think I run Life Orb, like, every time. What are people running for Armor Roche right now? Are they running Trick Room on it? Terra Grass. Oh, Terra Grass is usually a good idea, but I do like Psychic as well. 
Expanding force, trick room, armor cannon. There's no data yet. Um, do I run trick room? Here, I know I want expanding force and I know I want armor cannon. Um, oh, not arm thrust. Armor cannon. Hmm. Do I want to run? Maybe I run Will O Wisp in like a decently fast set. I think I do that. You know what? Let's do that. Um, we'll drop Life Orb for now. Or maybe I just do Specs, man. I, you know what? Let's just go Specs. Let's just go for it. No, I'm a coward. I'm going to do Scarf. I'm a coward. I'm running Scarf. Um, Do I want to do Timid or Modest? I could do Modest Scarf. No, I have to do Timid. Heat Wave. Because I need to have like a super offensive option, you know? Thanks for the Dedun Star Spin. I'm now Shiny Hunting for the Shiny Longboy. Nice. Should I just do energy ball as my last move? Yeah. Let's just do, let's keep it simple with this guy. Let's keep it simple. Dragon Swaggin, how you doing? Can I make this look pretty? I can make it look pretty. Let's make it look pretty. Why not? There we go. Or actually, wait, is there a better way to do that? 188. No. I'm going to make it look pretty. We get more out of the defense if we do it like that. Yeah, that's probably fine. That's probably fine. Blizzard. Um, Aurora Veil. Blizzard Aurora Veil Energy Ball, probably. Yeah. And for Vax Caliber, we'll just do this. Um, do I want to max out HP? I, I guess I get the most out of it by just maxing out HP. Why not? Do I want a reactive Terra Steel though? I'm trying to think. If I want a reactive Terra Steel, how often will that come into play? If I don't want to lose to Garchomp, I could actually do the, the Terra into something else. Because Garchomp has a chance to outspeed me, you know? Um. I, I, yeah, I don't do steel, otherwise Earthquake Garchomp annihilates me. Uh, I could do Terra Grass. That's not that bad, to be honest. Like, a lot of things want to be Grass-type to beat Garchomp. Um, flying also isn't that bad. I'm trying to think, what was this ground? Is it really just, like, flying in grass? Let's just keep it Dragon. Why not? Indeedy Female. Let's do... Uh, Safety goggles, follow me, protect, and um, what's the last move again? Protect, follow me, psychic, yeah. I like wanted to click expanding force, but I, I knew that wasn't the play. Let's do uh, relaxed. I could also do psychic seed. I could do psychic seed now that I think about it. I don't know, I don't have a goggles user right now anyways. That's probably fine. All right, let's try this out. Let's just hop on the ladder. Let's just see what we can do. Bug is kind of bad. I'm not gonna lie, whoever said bug, you're getting banned, no. Um, okay. So I really, really like the Obama Snow lead here because I don't think they can actually stop the follow me plus Aurora Veil. And we can do Backscalibur in the back. And I'm kind of feeling the uh, Scarf Armor Row is just like a cleanup crew. 
But Sylveon might be better as well. Annihilate's also not that bad. Let's do Annihilate because I just want to click the funny buttons. I have not used a single Annihilate. Ever. This is a true fact. A Dragon Arcanine? Um, unless they're like Heat Wave, I should be fine. Oh, I'm not Psychic Terrain. Guys, why did you not warn me that I didn't put Psychic Terrain on them? <laughs> why didn't you warn me? Alright, let's Aurora Veil follow me. I'm gonna get snarled, but it's probably fine as long as they're not nasty plot. As long as they don't hit me with the nasty. Maybe he won't notice. Yeah, no, look at the screen. There's snow. Maybe they just won't notice. Terra Steel, I figured that much. Annihilate's gonna be really good here. Yeah, actually, I might just go Annihilate right now. Um... Let's go Annihilate here and follow me. I max special defense. See, so yeah, I eat both of these hits. And now Backscalibur is a little bit scared of this, but I could just uh, Drain Punch Hydreigon. Yeah, I go Backscalibur here. Um, and I think I Terra. I Terra Fire and I go for my Drain Punch and I Protect. I could Dragon Dance. It's a little risky though. Do you guys believe? Do you guys I, I believe. I'm going to Dragon Dance. I believe. Go for it. Oh, go for it. <laughs> nice crit. We get the Dragon Dance off too. Dude, I think that's game. To be honest, I don't see how they come back from that. Like, yeah, the chomp is in, but I just protect here and protect. I'm good. He can't burn me? We're gaming. Moxie Believer. Do, do we have any believers in chat? By the way, I am ordering new emotes because I know we have a lot of subscribers now. I'm ordering new emotes. Don't worry. They're coming in. They are coming in. Stream speed. If he swords dances, he's Dunyan Rings. Did he just Earthquake on me? The disrespect. The disrespect. Here, let me drain punch you and... Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. That's that's heat. That's heat. By the way, guys, I just want to announce, I'm 10 pounds lighter than I was uh, three weeks ago. I, I, I think it's because I'm just an adult who forgets to eat nowadays. But I have been working out a lot. Uh, I just thought I would share. I was very proud of that. All right. Uh, they're also a hail team, so if I'm not getting up my if I'm not getting up my thingity thing, I'm losing. Um, also, Armor Rogue looks insane in the back, so let's do Armor Rogue Annihilate. I'm always gonna say it wrong. I'm never gonna say it right. I'm crazy. How's the music, by the way? Too loud? Too quiet? Let me know. Also, these are new beats. Wait, is this the same beat over and over again? Am I stupid? It might be. I don't know. Quiet, I'll turn it up a little bit. There you go. Alright. Um do, do, do. Let me get my soundboard up. I, I want to get a soundboard ready. That's a Cyclozar, so they're just going to do some, like, real sussy stuff. I think what they're going to do, actually, what they're going to do here is they're going to flip turn on me and then, like, shed tail and get in their Cyclozar, but I simply don't care. Let's go ahead and uh, follow me and Aurora Veil. I'm not too scared of Palafin, to be honest. They're going to wrap. Hello? Close combat. Hello? What? What? Sir, I could have trick room there and you would have been Dunyan Rings. What are they even going to do? Right, let's just psychic and like blizzard like I don't care but listen Obama snow is gonna eat up this close combat like it's nothing I guarantee it like think about it we we have Aurora Veil and we have the the defense boost from uh <laughs> we have the defense boost from the hail wait no there's no way I dropped to like anything Ross Moth? I don't care I don't care I psychic here man I don't care if you're taking half damage from this I I literally don't care if you're taking half damage from this uh, let's go for Psychic into Frostmoth, and I'm going to get in my Armor Roche. Actually, uh, 
don't want to get I psychic into you and I get an armor roach here because I can just follow me away the palafin granted uh, Frostmoth can deal some decent damage someone brought the singles team to VGC yeah right I gotta get my main account higher up on the ladder otherwise I'm gonna keep facing stuff like this man Should I be weak armor? I think I should be weak armor. Not nah, flash fire is probably fine. All right. Oh, oh, I can't follow me. I'm a silly little guy. Uh, I do outspeed everything here though, so I can just psychic frost moth and I think I just want to armor cannon it because Palafin doesn't beat me. Water type? Okay, maybe that maybe that won't do it. Palafin still doesn't beat this team, though. I mean, I, I go Obama Snow here, and Frostmoth doesn't get Roost, it gets Giga Drain. So I should be able to just do my thing. Let me uh, protect here, and I'm going to go for Energy Ball on the Frostmoth. I don't think they ever KO me, even with the double up. Actually, I, I should technically follow me in Energy Ball, because Annihilate wins the endgame. Yeah, that's fine. Annihilate comes in. And I did lose my defense boost, but I should still eat everything from Palafin and stuff. Baxcalibur? I simply don't care, man. Let me bulk up right here. I'm going to bulk up and wall him out for the rest of the game. Uh, let's go for the... Uh... Do I Terra Grass here? I think I Terra Grass here. And I just Energy Ball you. Because I don't want to drop to close combat in case they are like Choice Banded. Incredible. All right, that's game. Go for the Drain Punch. Uh, go for the Energy Ball. Or I guess Blizzard's fine. It's not resistant. Ah, eh, let's just Drain Punch. Blizzard, why not? Yeah, why would you do that again? You're done. All right, GG. I actually really like this team so far. Granted, we're still low ladder because I have to like climb out of there with this account. Uh, Meow Scarada stuff. Also, you. You're kind of crazy. Uh, I really like the Annihilate lead here. Like, I can honestly just do like the Obama Snow and Didi and like go Annihilate and like go crazy versus them. I have to be careful with you though, so I think I end up going uh, Armor Roach in the back again. Because Armor Roach with Scarf can like Annihilate things. You ever talk about Pokemon at work? No. I think I've mentioned it once or twice that I do this to like a coworker that I like trust doesn't care enough to like look me up. It's not that I'm embarrassed of it, it's just like not work relevant, you know? Uh, the thing is. Excadrill was never legal online. This indeed he is for some reason. Ooh, am I going to be able to eat this? Probably not. I think I go into my armor roach here. And I attempt... Or actually, I could just protect Trick Room. Yeah, I'm going to protect in Trick Room here. What? What? Yeah, we're going Armor Rouge. Uh, and I'm going to Psychic you. I don't care anymore. I don't care anymore. No, we're not dealing with it. I'm not playing with you. Go home. Everyone's trick rooming, man. Everyone's trick rooming. I got my Flash Fire boost. That's pretty cool. Uh, I'm not going to be clicking it. I am just going to Expanding Force. And is there a point to follow me in here? I think I just protect because I'm Scarf. I outspeed here. That does a lot. Yeah, next one KOs. That shouldn't do much to me. Oh, okay. That did do a lot. Are you like strong boy? Uh, I am Scarf, so I outspeed. There's no reason not to Psychic the Indeedee. 
And nothing switches into this except for Meowskarata, which I don't particularly care about. Because they still don't know that I'm Scarf. All they know is that I outsped. I forgot, I'm Timid, so I'm outspeeding Dragapult, right? No, but I should still run Timid. Do you like the field of astrophysics or not really a thing? I mean, I'm a physicist. I'm just not an astrophysicist. So, like, I, I could get into astrophysics, uh, but, but what I'm really interested in is, like, quantum stuff. Meowskarada. Uh, let's go ahead and... What's the safest way of doing this? I think I get in a Bombus now. No, because I want him in for later. I think I get in Annihilate here and follow me. Do I? Oh, wait, that's really risky. Uh, yeah, because endgame Armorage can win this. And there's one turn left to Psychic Terrain. Okay, here's how I think I do it. Because they're going to want to go for Flower Trick onto my Armorage. Assuming that, the Psychic will end up going into the Indeedee slot. So it's safest to get a Nihilape in there and a Bomb of Snow in here. Yeah, that's the safest way to do this. Because I just lock, like, Armor Cannon. Or I lock Heat Wave to win the endgame. Does Meowskarata get Sucker Punch? It does. Okay, so I'm going to need that terrain. Uh, looks like I managed to dodge something really annoying there. That did hurt, though. Let's go for Protect here. And... I can try to Blizzard. That's really risky, though. You know, I think I get an Indeedee. That's probably safer, actually. Because, like I said, Scarf, uh, Scarf Armor Roche just wins. Because I should one-shot Meowskarata. Black did 77% though, man. Helping hand. Flower trick. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and... Do I Drain Punch or Rage Fist? I think I follow me and I try to Drain Punch me Oscarada. To get some health back. And I should lose my Ndidi here, but I don't think I lose my uh, Annihilate after the recovery. And the reason I'm doing this is because I really need to get uh, Armorosion for free. All right, yeah, we're good. Uh, let's get in. You, you're no longer Dark type, so I can just click this now. Uh, let me go for a bulk up to secure the end game, and Expanding Force will KO the Meowskarata from this range. Because there's no reason to target anything here. God, Annihilate's so good, dude. He's really fat is the thing. Like, he's hard to KO. Seth, thanks so much for the follow. Honestly, I'm pretty sure I can get this team in game, like, today. The hardest thing is going to be Terra Fire Annihilate, but everything else is very doable. Like, the, the Sylveon's done, the Obama Snow I can get in like 5 minutes. I expect Scalibur, I believe, defaults to Terra Dragon, so I just get that immediately. Goodbye. And I bulk up here. My Rage for Shikeo, like everything. Like, what comes in here? Like, nothing? Mouse hold four? Yeah, okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. That's game. GG. Like, what do you do? I outspeed you with this guy. If you live, I'd be real surprised. It's, it's a real strong hit, you know? When is Dumb Dumb Sparse gonna make it in another video? Who knows, man? Who knows? Maybe I'll make it in game. How do you like the down dose teams that do well in the tournament? They all were really cool. Uh, I think the most interesting one was the uh, substitute uh, sleep talk one. 
or like the rest sleep talk body press one that one was really cool um GLHF how do I do this this is a rain team uh Obama snow goes second so I could just go for it immediately if they lead off with this guy and I think I do the max caliber annihilate By the way, I have a question. I have a question for you guys. Uh, I need to do a Patreon series soon. How would you guys feel about a Patreon series where I just have a dedicated Dondozo laddering account and just figure out the optimal Dondozo? Yeah, I just Aurora over here and like follow me. Go ahead and flip turn, I don't care. Oh wait, they're gonna go into Pelipper, I'm an idiot. Oh, you silly goose, Marcos. You really messed up this time. Um, yeah, I really messed up there. Honestly, I think I just go for the follow me. No, if I can get a bomb of snow in, I can secure. I can secure this. So I think I follow me and I get an Annihilate here. Or even Backscalibur safe. As long as they don't discharge, which I don't think they will. Hopefully they KO my Ndidi. As long as they don't U-turn with Pelipper here, they should KO Ndidi, I think. They Tailwind? Uh, that's fine. I'm just going to follow me and uh, Dragon Dance. I don't know if Pelipper can KO me with this. It's, it's Hurricane strong, but it's not like that strong. Yep, we're fine. Dragon Dance up. Nice. Okay, that's what I wanted because now I get in the Obama Snow. And they can't stop my setup. Yeah. Because they can't put me to sleep with this guy. And I just like always... Uh, I think I always tear a dragon here. Is there a point in tearing it? I don't think I tear it just yet because I don't want to Glaive Rush. Ice Skill Spear might do it. No, maybe I do just go for the KO. It's really risky. Um, Yeah, let's just annihilate you. And uh, I'll try to Aurora Veil. Let's just annihilate this Amoongus. There's no way you live this. <laughs> you know what? I said there's no way you live it, but I kind of thought it might. I kind of thought that it might. I'm not going to lie there. All right. Uh, I have to protect here because the next turn I take damage. Uh, it's also the last turn of Tailwind for them. Protect. Uh, I don't want to get an Annihilate just yet. Let's just go for Blizzard see how much damage you can do. Because I think Screen's, uh, Screen's Rage Fist just beats everything in the back if I play my cards right. I mean, they might be they might be Tailwind Kilowatt Troll, but if I get this Blizzard off, that'd be great. Yeah, I landed on the Kilowatt Troll, so I like that's that's just like a win, um, because I Ice Skull Spear here to KO Kilowatt Troll, and I think I go Annihilate, because I can't KO Pelipper first. Excalibur is kind of nasty, dude. Ooh, are they going to go for it? They got the Tailwind off. I still just Ice Skull Spear you and then like go right back into Obama. Get that defense boost and also to possibly block a Hurricane. It won't block it, but it decreases accuracy, you know? Oh, dude, Palafin's not eating this that well, dude. One, two, three, four... That was a lot. Yeah, and I, I managed to dodge that. Yeah, there's no way he KOs me. I have no I have no weakness to this guy. So I think what I'm gonna do is Glaive Rush the Palafin to like clean up the game. And I go for a blizzard. Or actually, I could just 
I'm pretty sure Obama still lives this. I think what I actually do is I Ice School Spear Pelipper and like Energy Ball Palafin. Yeah, because I get through the Kilowatt roll. Ice Punch. Oh, that did a lot. Is he going to freeze me though? No, he's not. Flavor Rush. Also, it, it looks like it didn't take my input for some reason. Clayrush is such a good move. Yeah, GG. Nice. Let's get another. We need Don Doza wearing the Subway Master uniform. Oh, hold on. Wait. There you go. All right. Um, Let's get back to this. Ooh, okay. This is going to be some like hyper offense stuff. I don't know how I feel about anything but Armor Rogue. I kind of really need the Obama Snow to come in clutch here, to be honest. Uh, but, oh, Baxcalibur is like really good. Baxcalibur is really good here, especially with Ndidi lead. I think I do this. I think I do this. And Armor Rogue in the back. No one I like this game. Yeah, follow me and Didi goes crazy. Oh my god. Let's, uh, let's follow me and I'm going to Dragon Dance. Oh no, I think I just Ice Skull Spear you get rid of you <laughs> you silly goose you absolute stinky oh wait hold on please please don't please. okay we're good <laughs> crisis averted check this out that's an attack boost right there that's an attack boost right there i'm sorry bro i'm sorry bro what are you gonna do about this what are you gonna do about that that glaive rush you're not taking that well let me psychic you too you're not eating this Glaive Rush. That's plus one Glaive Rush. Goodbye. <laughs> Wait, this Pokemon's busted. This Pokemon's broken. Why would anyone make this? Let me Glaive Rush you now. I'm going to Glaive Rush you. I'm going to go for the Psychic onto you. I don't care. Actually, I should follow me. I'm going to Glaive... Actually, no. I Glaive Rush the Torkoal and I follow me here because I went with like everything else in the back. Oh, Saxmaster4. GG, you've been seeing a lot of your content on YouTube. I just don't look at your username when the match starts. Hey, good game. Odd meter music. I take it you are actually a Saxmaster. All right, yeah, that crit didn't matter at plus one. Terra Blast, I don't care. Listen, listen. <laughs> I think I love Baxcalibur, dude. I think I think I just found like my new favorite Pokemon this gen, except for Don Dozo. Listen, Don Dozo has my heart. I am the Don Ductor. But whenever Don Dozo needs a break, I think it's Baxcalibur time, man. Ooh, this is uh, this is Aaron Trailer's team, if I believe. If I'm correct, I mean. Hmm. Uh, obviously, Baxcalibur is in a little bit of trouble if we don't get that off. But I think what I do here to guarantee I get some value on lead is I go Special Defensive Annihilate and I Terra Fire. And I Rage Fist this guy. Yeah, so I, I can guarantee some value that way. And I go Armor Rogue. I think my last Mon, how do I do this? I think I go Sylveon, man, but then I, I yeah, because I need to, I like hard lose to Goldango otherwise, but do I go back Caliber? It's a little risky. No, I go Sylveon. Uh, yeah, this is fine. Let me bulk up. Oh, wait, but if he's Haze Murkrow, we're in trouble. I think I just Drain Punch. Follow me. No, I can trigger him, actually. Oh, I think he's going to follow me Tailwind, maybe. I just can't take a beat up with my... Sylveon can eat it. Let's just trick him, man. Listen, if indeed he gets Trick Room and Psychic Terrain and all these tools, it's actually straight up a Murkrow answer. It's straight up a Murkrow answer. Terra normal, okay. Am I going down? I might be going down. Don't land all of them. Don't land all of them. Don't land all of them. Don't land. Don't. Don't do this. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> Why would you do that to me? I hate it here. Um. I believe in Annihilate. I believe in Annihilate. Check this out. I'm going to bulk up on him. 
No, I just drain punch. Wait, that's gonna power the hell out of my rage fist. If I live this, that's gonna power up the hell out of my rage fist, dude. I wanna, like, I kinda hope I live this. Cause I have the citrus berry, I think I live. It's not guaranteed to hit 10 times unless they're like wide lens. How much did it hit me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm pretty sure Aaron Trailer isn't running wide lens either. I'm pretty sure he's Sash. You can't your ghost? Oh, that's true. I'm a stinky guy, aren't I? Um, I can live this. I can he's not gonna land all 10. I guarantee it. That's the Moxie boost to guarantee. Listen, that's the okay. <laughs> Foul play, that's fine. Drain punch. Get all my health back. Armor Rouge comes in. Pretty sure I lost that. Oh, I did not expect the population bomb to actually KO me there. I was like, I can probably take one. I'm max defense. I forgot what type population bomb was. It's my bad, guys. Uh, I'm not Terra Grass, but I can get rid of my weakness here. And Drain Punch. I can also bulk up, but it's that's like risky. I think I drain punch to be safe. Armorage can eat one, but the foul play is going to hurt is the issue. Dang, I'm kind of tempted to protect my Annihilate here. Yeah, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to protect Annihilate. No, no, it's too risky. Yeah, let's just do it. Rock slide? Okay, I'm fine with that. I get a Rage Fist boost. Foul play? I'm fine with that. I'm gonna get my Citrus Barrier. Just don't flinch me. All right. No flinch? Let's go. Okay. Um, I don't think I lose to Hydreigon now because I have so many Rage Fist boosts. Yeah. He doesn't know that I'm locked is the issue. He's gonna tear a steel, right? I can live this, I can live this, I can live this. All I have to do is deal with the hide. Actually, I should always like drain punch, shouldn't I? I should actually always be drain punching. Otherwise I like lose to Murkrow if it gets like enough damage off. Target the armor rose. Don't recognize that I'm Scarf. Don't recognize that I'm Scarf, come on. Just think that I'm like a real bulky guy. Yeah, the reason I can't Rage Fist here is because if I do, it'll like probably knock him out, but oh, he he recognized that I'm probably Scarf. Okay, GG. Listen, I that, that population bomb, it really does hurt. It really does hurt. Luckily, that's our first loss for the night, so I'm kind of cool with it. All right. Uh, um, easy. Easy points. All right. Let's do one more, and then we'll switch to in-game and start building this team, because this is really nasty. Uh, this is gonna be like Flamigo co-star stuff, man. I'm thinking it's gonna be like beat up strats with you, maybe? Like weakness policy stuff? Pretty sure I'm always able to get off my, my guy though, unless they like lead off Armor Rogue. And then I can just go back Excalibur. Let's do this. They did lead off with that. Oh man. Let's uh... Let's protect Trick Room. Oh, they didn't do it. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and go for the Aurora Veil. And I kind of want to get up. Don't want to get on Annihilate here. No, that's too risky. Let's just go for damage onto you. I want to get something in for free, but I don't think it's this. All right. Um, now I feel like Annihilate's a little bit safe, but I'm kind of scared of the Armor Roche. Honestly, I think I just spam damage until my Trick Room's gone, because I still have Aurora Veil and stuff. Even get a lucky freeze. This is a really awkward lead. All right. Um, 
Yeah, because I can get an Annihilate next turn and protect. So I think what I do here is I... No, I Blizzard. And I'm actually willing to go back Excalibur here, to be honest. Because he doesn't drop to anything. And I can protect. Yeah, because I don't want to lose my Indeedee. Are you forgetting about this? Alright, check it out. The Freeze. Easy Freeze. Easy, Freezy, beautiful cover girl. Let's get in the Annihilate. I have... Five turns left of Aurora Veil, that's enough to work with. Let me protect here, and I think next turn I just go for Rage Fist and Glaive Rush into the Armor Roach. Yeah. Oh, he just weakness policy himself. Let me Terra Fire and Rage Fist you? I'm not dealing with that. I could actually... <sighs> yeah, I have to Rage Fist. Um, and we can try to Dragon Dance, I'm pretty sure I just go down though. All right, I live. Awesome. I get a Rage Fist boost. I get a Dragon Dance off. We're like gaming here. We're absolutely gaming. Drain Punch you, Icicle Spear you. Don't care. Why are you clicking all these moves? They don't do anything. All right, I can eat this hit. Oh, no, I can't. That's, uh, that's a little bit unfortunate. I can't lie. Uh, let me bulk up. Oh no, they just form it. Okay, listen, we'll take it. That was a little bit of a weak ending to the to the team building session, but I'm sure the team works fine. We did pretty good. Only drop one game. And I do think this is a really scary team. So we're gonna build it right now in game. Let me switch over to in-game, guys. I'll be right back. I'll be back in like two seconds. See ya. And if you're watching on YouTube in the team building section, obviously, you know, leave a like, subscribe, do whatever. This was a fun one. I'll see you guys soon.